The first reason you should try out the demo of Zephan is the fantastic turn-based combat system that is the hallmark of the talented developers at Proxy Studios, who created the Warhammer 40,000 title which has received nothing but glowing reviews for over 5 years. They have managed to transfer everything they created there and even add new combat mechanics into the totally new and original IP which is set in a near future cyberpunk post-apocalypse on Earth after an alien invasion which was partially stopped by an AI whose motives still remain unknown. Not only do you have the standard system of attack, counter-attack and terrain bonuses, but there are also units which can transport others, use different types of weapons depending on the combat range, as well as additional consumable weapons and items you can pick up or research to equip your units and heroes. Those heroes do not just get more HP when they level up, but also points which you can use to improve several abilities they can use, like adding cover, improved accuracy or morale of nearby units, and even a powerful bombardment ability at higher levels. Regular units also level up as they defeat enemies and earn XP points. The second reason to play Zephan are the absolutely stunning maps and 6 different climate types. You will locate caches of rewards, capture outposts for buffs, find natural and artificial hazards along with special phenomena as well as natural enemies and hostile lifeforms. There are flesh trees, microchip factories, traveling sandstorms, erupting volcanoes and many more all with special bonuses and negative stats you will have to learn to work and travel around. The violent wildlife, like mutated animals, can hide in cliffsides, ruins and deformed woodland, and if you go far enough you will even find NPC factions to fight and conquer or make a deal with. This is where the diplomacy system comes in, but you won't get too much use out of it in the demo and a small map with a few NPCs to deal with. The third reason to enjoy this game is the city building and development. You start with a tech unit which has the ability to construct roads and cities. Once you pick a desirable tile, you build your city and headquarters and start expanding. Tile by tile and turn by turn and spend many types of resources starting with the mundane like minerals, food and power to more exotic ones like chips or algae. New buildings are constructed here but they share the build queue with the city's expansion and forest removal jobs. All the different natural and unnatural map elements come into play here as they boost different production buildings you can build on these tiles and most will accept more than one building. These also consume some resources and will generate others, so there is a whole balancing act to follow when adding new buildings to the city which is also guarded by its headquarters with missiles and walls. The fourth reason I want to give you for playing Zephan is the tech tree, divided into 10 tiers, which isn't just about advancement through 150 different technologies, but also about choosing a path to change. You might want to keep your humanity intact, but you will lose access to many units and abilities the other two paths, voice and cyber, will unlock for you. They are asymmetric, but also not mutually exclusive, and as they require different resources, mixing is more difficult, but also more rewarding. Some tech unlocks new buildings and units, other bonuses to resource production, and some give you totally new weapons to use by your units in battle. The fifth and final reason for playing is the wealth of choices, which come up as you play both randomly and due to specific events. Here you are presented with potential choices, whose exact effects on your faction you won't be able to see until you make a choice. They aren't black and white or good and evil, they are just opportunities for you to pick and live with the consequences. It is entirely possible to pick an option which won't have any effect, positive or negative. I hope you enjoyed the showcase of Zephan and its demo version which will be available on Steam from August 3rd to August 10th. Link is in the description, for more turn-based games check out the card on the screen. Thank you for watching and happy gaming!